Hello everyone. These are the results of the specimens that were run today. And if you'll notice, um, the one patient had very clear plasma or serum at this point, And the other patient um, had a little bit of a hazier look to the serum. And if you look uh, on the results, the triglycerides are the difference there. So triglycerides, if they're elevated or, uh, you know, within a certain range, they're going to cause the uh, specimen to be a little more hazy than the other. So a good rule of thumb is if it's clear, you're expecting there to be less than 200 um, milligrams per deciliter of triglycerides triglycerides in the plasma or the serum. If it's hazy, it could be 200 to 300 milligrams per deciliter. Um, the one on the left is slightly hazy, but as you can see on the, on the printout, it wasn't 200. So it's a rule of thumb. It's not, you know, completely accurate or something that you can um, use as a diagnostic tool. Uh, so that's the difference with those. And when you interpret these results, you want to, uh, if you're doing a calculated LDL, you want to make sure that the triglycerides are not greater than 400 because if they are, the Friedwald calculation becomes invalid and not accurate. And at that point, you would need to actually uh, perform a measured LDL, which we don't actually have on our instrument. So um, the Friedwall calculation is a total uh, cholesterol minus HDL minus triglycerides over five. So if you have elevated triglycerides that are over 400, that, that calculation becomes obsolete. Um, a situation in which you would have elevated triglycerides, which could be the reason for um, the elevated triglycerides in uh, this result was because the patient had eaten beforehand. Both of these are actually random specimens. They are not fasting lipid panels. So uh, the clinician would see these results and then uh, decide whether or not to have the patient do a fasting uh, lipid panel. Notice also the instrument called this a lipemic um, reaction of one plus on the patient that was hazy. So that kind of goes along with it. Thank you for watching. And if you would like to continue to see videos, please subscribe and you'll automatically get updates when I put the videos up. Talk to you later. Bye.